spitters and everything. And I don't want to get stuck inside and not have a way out. So I definitely still want to knock down his flag. Yep, sleep, okay. And engineers and a purifier. Hey guys and welcome back to another Wasteland Survival episode. And in this one, like we said in the last one, it is going to be all about raiding people. Um, we're essentially we're, we're looking for those those hoses. So um, what I one thing that I did end up doing though is I did essentially turn my flag on and off. And the reason I did that is I wanted to reset um, my credit and rank so that way. The people I see have, uh, they're a little bit more susceptible to being raided. Um, as I ranked up, the amount of people that were, that I could attack, their defenses were just a little bit, um, too good to the point where, um, I was spending more resources than I would typically get back. Um, so that, I just didn't want to continue to do that, because really raiding for me is all about getting the resources. And now one other really interesting thing that um, ended up happening and um, definitely is going to be beneficial eventually is the PP rewards. I've been silver and gold before, but it says that I haven't claimed them. So, I mean, if, if that works and that glitches out that I can claim these and then restart and then claim them again over and over and over again, that might not be a terrible way to find yourself uh, with uh, a couple hundred coins essentially for nothing. So uh, eventually I'm going to try that again, see if it glitches out like that. Um, but uh, if it does, then uh, I'll definitely, you guys should do that to get those coins. But, but I'm not 100% sure that it's always going to do that. i got to do it at least one more time to make sure. So, but we're just going to attack some lower level people here. Um, I'm not expecting them to have the uh, the hoses. But uh, you never know what people have. I've run into some people that have had things that I thought they definitely shouldn't have had. Like very low level people with copper before. Um, which I mean at those levels I never had copper. So I was, I was surprised to see that they did. Okay, so his flag is most likely going to be right over here. Yep. Okay, we'll fight your dog friend. Okay, I don't know why Brutus is not me at all. That was kind of weird. I was kind of waiting for Brutus to kind of step in there, but uh, he just never did. Thanks, bud. Thanks, pup. Looks like we're going to have another fight here on our hands. And again, Brutus just stands there. Why? Don't know. Yeah, I th I'm feeling like this person might be a bust, but... That's alright. At least I'll take the gunpowder. Unless, for whatever reason, he has a hose. Uh, I am lower on copper. Let's take the copper ore. Take the gunpowder this time. Because I need lots of gunpowder. And it's harder to come by than copper. And we'll take some more iron. 
bandages. This room probably has nothing but junk in it, but we'll have a look anyway. Oh, it does have some chests. Now will this be empty? Because it's probably where he keeps his... Okay, there's some stuff in here. But again, nothing of significant value. And more nails. Now, I guess I could take all these nails and go with 20 nails. That's probably better than 20. Okay. Yes. There, now Brutus wants to come out and help. And now all of my stuff is damaged. But that's okay, because it was low anyway already. So now at least I can take it all off and have it repaired. Let's see anything in here worth taking out. No. Alright, so I would say that this bit of a bust on this particular raid, but I'm kind of expecting that. I don't expect to, uh, to run into the, uh, um, the hoses right away. I'm expecting to take a little bit of time. Yep, we'll send and settle that. And we'll credit, we'll go up, our rank will go down, and now we're silver. Perfect. Now we'll be able to take more things home including a green slot and a blue slot so now we won't have to make that decision anymore between the copper and the um the gunpowder do i have something here i thought i did we'll just equip this i guess i could have thrown something back in there already equip here actually that is garbage this is garbage. I uh, will put the pants I think we'll put in there. So we'll leave the boots here. And we will then equip here, equip there. Let's go fix the pants. Which means it needs more iron plates. I think I have an iron plate down here. I do. But we'll need more than just one iron plate. I have to make some. Make sure I have, yep, lamps in here. I'll put those in there. And I will also take some iron and get some iron plates started. Oh, it was actually it was the leather I was short on. Not the iron plates, but that's alright. We'll get that going, get that all fixed up. And we will still make some more iron plates, whether it will be for nail production or for um, fixing my equipment. Uh, but we will need some more planks. So we will need to create some more tools for us here. And then we'll just need to run over and grab some glue. Oh, no, I'm going to keep that in there. And it will just be... Do you have space for another? I do. Perfect. Okay. And we will just put the glue back, put the iron back, and the plates back, or planks. Always hungry. dog friend make sure he's all happy with me and uh, we should be good to go to raid somebody else yeah it's gonna take a while i don't expect to find those hoses right away i'm also not exactly attacking the people that i think will have the hoses right away but i think we're gonna go for the shining darkness time he's got a little bit more prosperity hopefully being level 29, he's been through Shelter 13 and potentially has a hose for us. Doubtful, but that would be nice. Is his animals alive? 
it looks like they might be, so let's attack him from the back side. Let's see, does he have a spot of weakness? Yes, he does. Or she, don't know which one it is, but... Uh, one, some damage. Are you gonna be stone, aren't you? Well, I'm glad that I got a whole bunch of more uh, axes and whatnot. Come on, thank you. The only, of course it'd be the only two. Does he have a turret? That's the real question. It does, and it's in the front, and he has a turret right there, right by his flag. Hmm. Where is he going to go? I'm going to go take it out. Perfect. This is why you bring the doggo along with you. Although I can't see its health. But it's definitely bleeding out now, which is good. Which is interesting because somehow the, the bleeding effect um, activates against a, a steel component. But okay. No big deal. What was extra damage. There it goes again. Bleeding away. Okay, so now that's put down. And we will essentially have free access to his flag. All food. What kind of garbage is that? I should have brought better weapons here though, because I think I'm going to run out of picks. And I don't think I'll have enough weapons to defend myself against large zombie invasion. If I can even find... The, uh... Well, I mean, we'll start with this. These are easy. And we'll have a look at these. Just for the probability. And of course they're all going to be empty, aren't they? Okay, so they're all empty. have to hope that I have pickaxes to open up all the boxes. Uh, we don't have... I thought I had the uh... and spots, but I think I don't. Not yet. So this is a good one here. It's got some copper in there. Some iron. some more chests and we'll just see what we got here before we make any decisions on what we're going to take. Alcohol's not bad. I'll eventually need that to make my ethanol, I'm pretty sure. Yep, don't want any of those. I have to be careful because it's soon going to be the uh, spitters and everything. I don't want to get stuck inside and not have a way out. So I definitely still want to knock down his flag. Yep, see, okay. And engineers and a purifier. I think that's going to be it on this one. Come on, knock him down. 
Okay, get out of there. And we have to quickly assign this over there. Keep running. That way I can regain some health here. Okay. Hit him again. That's lots of guys here. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. We gotta kind of pull him away and then fight him. Okay, so the rest of those guys I can run from. We essentially want to now get back inside the base, take out the flag. And I'm pretty sure there is nothing else that I want to take. Oh, this is going to launch another invasion, isn't it? Yep, it did. So let's just get out of here. We don't want to fight anymore. Okay. Okay, okay so that wasn't terrible. I mean, we got some resources again. Still, no hose. But uh, it's going to take a while to find it. I'm not expecting to uh, for it to show up out of nowhere. So we're just going to have to uh, continue to raid people as we go until I find that hose. Because I've yet to find it anywhere else. So um, I think the next target we'll have might be Bo's, Bo's, uh, Bohosa or uh, Mr. Moose, maybe. We'll see. It might be not too bad, but we still have to wait two hours for our next one, so. Um, with that being said, guys, that's all the rating we have for today. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.